The Free Methodist Church was founded in 1860 in the United States and in 1880 expanded northward into Canada. By 1881, the church had moved into India, following just a few years later into South Africa and Mozambique. In the next 25 years, the church would multiply into the Dominican Republic, Japan, Egypt, and China. By 1935, the Free Methodist Church spread to Mexico, Brazil, and the small African country of Burundi. By the celebration of its first 100 years, the church would add an additional seven countries. In the next 25 years, from 1961 to 1985, another seven countries were engaged, but from 1986 to 2010, Free Methodists moved into 50 more countries, bringing the total to 76 countries. Since 2010, in just 13 years, another 24 countries have been added to the Free Methodist family, now in over 100 countries. The trajectory of expansion is encouraging. At the same time, worldwide membership in the Free Methodist Church has grown from its inception in 1860 to over one and a half million members in 2023. Most Free Methodists are African, with over 800,000 Free Methodist members just in Rwanda, Burundi, and the Democratic Republic of the Congo. The Free Methodist Church in Africa, with eight established general conferences, continues to grow steadily in spite of war, famine, and persecution the African members number more than 940,000. Free Methodist World Missions has been pouring its energies into West Africa, where in the last 10 years we have entered into 10 new countries. With the diversity of language and culture in West Africa, it became evident that we needed a school to help Africans become cross-cultural missionaries. The Wesley Missionary Institute opened in 2019 just outside of Lome, Togo, and in 2022 graduated its first class of 12 students. Praise the Lord, God is using Karoma, a recent graduate serving by faith in a remote village in Sierra Leone. God is working. There are testimonies of miracles, healing, and people giving their lives to Christ. We anticipate thousands of people will come to Christ through the training of leaders at the Wesley Missionary Institute. On the other side of the continent, under persecution, famine, and distress, the Free Methodist Church in Ethiopia continues to grow. Superintendent McBib Desta reported last year of more than 2,000 conversions and over 900 baptisms. Conversions are happening in every church. In Asia, there are three general conferences, India, Japan, and the Philippines, with a combined membership of approximately 366,000 people. There is a growing work in Creative Access Country PK, where in March there was an evangelistic outreach with 1,500 people in attendance and nearly 900 people gave their lives to Jesus. This little girl was taken to the hospital where the doctors told her parents she was dead and they should go ahead and take her to be buried. Instead, friends suggested that they take her to a Free Methodist leader. After a long drive through the night, they arrived with their dead daughter. As the pastor turned to the Lord in prayer, Miriam began to breathe again. The Lord raised her from the dead. She is alive and a joyful little girl, and her parents have become believers in Jesus. In Creative Access Country MR, in the midst of a pandemic and a military coup, the church baptized over 200 new believers in 2021. Hundreds of people are coming to Christ across Southeast Asia, forming new churches and reaching out to the least of these. The Asia area has a goal of influencing one million people toward Christ. The Free Methodist Church in India continues to grow while creating opportunities for those lowest in the old caste system, now having opportunities for education and personal development through Emmanuel University. In Europe, the Free Methodist Church in Portugal has planted churches in the African countries of Sao Tome and Principe, as well as in Guinea-Bissau. The Free Methodist Church in the Democratic Republic of the Congo has planted churches in Sweden with refugees relocated by the United Nations. These churches are multiplying and plans are in place to plant churches in Norway, Finland and Denmark. The Europe area has established an African-European church network engaging in church planting among African immigrants across the continent. The Free Methodist Church in Europe, particularly in Hungary, has been a vital link to serving refugees pouring out of Ukraine. 
Free Methodists with the Set Free Movement serve the European Freedom Network by providing much needed signs which give escaping refugees information on how to avoid human trafficking. In 2020, the Balkans Annual Conference was established with 26 churches, the first Free Methodist Annual Conference formed in Europe since the establishment of the United Kingdom Annual Conference in 1981. In Latin America, there are three general conferences, Brazil, Dominican Republic, and Haiti, with the Provisional General Conferences of Mexico and the Nikkei Provisional General Conference in Brazil. The Free Methodist Church has been active in Latin America for 132 years. There is work in nearly every Latin American country with the work expanding. Recently, with a vision for the biblical restoration of Latin America, the church in Latin America has been working in unity across countries and cultures, planting house churches. There are nearly 1,000 house churches. There have been over 6,000 new believers in the past two years through community church plants. There also continue to be traditional churches planted from Mexico to Patagonia. In the Middle East, Egypt is the only general conference, but the general work of the Free Methodists have been expanding rapidly through the house church movement. Hundreds of thousands of believers meet in homes, fields, and storefronts. The work is currently in eight countries with hundreds of thousands of people meeting in over 6,000 house churches. Immigration seems to be one of the main means the Holy Spirit is using to expand the kingdom of God. As millions of people are both forcibly displaced or displaced by choice, the Spirit is opening new opportunities. We have seen strong evidence of this in all world areas. With immigration and the diaspora of the church, there is also the blessing of breaking down cultural barriers through hybridity. The beautiful bride of Christ is growing. It is a blessing to be a part of the global movement called the Free Methodist Church.